Welcome everybody. Just wanted to uh, do maybe a little bit something different. Uh, just to show some progress in a game I've been working on for a little while now. Um, but yeah, I've been playing this game. Uh, it's been a... I'm not sure when I started it, but uh, I've been playing it with my cousin. Uh, we usually play most of the LEGO games. Um, and we just go through and complete them completely, basically. Uh, we get everything, try to get 100% for everything. So, this is LEGO Indiana Jones 2, The Adventure Continues. As see seen on the Wii, um, actually I'm using the Wii U console at this point, but uh, pretty much it's the Wii version. And yeah, we've gone through and 100%ed uh, each of these chapters here, uh, which includes basically getting a true adventure on every level, uh, both treasure mode and uh, story mode, as well as getting all the red, green, and blue bricks, as well as the super bonus level in each one of them, unlocking each character and each vehicle. So, I mean, there's quite a bit to unlock in this game. This game was a lot of fun, for sure. I wouldn't say it's probably my favorite LEGO game for, by any means, um, but uh, um, as of right now, I think my favorite one is LEGO Batman, the first one, but I haven't played the second one completely yet. But uh, yeah, this game was actually a lot of fun. I've liked almost every LEGO game I've played. Um, but yeah, figured I'd just show up some of the progress here. So really, the only thing left, which I'm actually currently working on right now, is stud collecting lots of fun grinding it out uh um so yeah my uh we basically got up to about 50 billion um by the time we completed everything like got 100 percent on each of the stages um so all we had left was to basically try to max out the stud counter and usually in a lego game you know you get about four billion four and a half billion somewhere in that range you know not too high so yeah, we were at 50 billion, and now um, we're basically trading the game back and forth. So like he finished uh, up to 500 billion, so it's my job to get it up to about 950 billion, and then we'll probably do the last 50 billion uh, together, more than likely. So <laughs> yeah, ridiculous, I know, but uh, hey, it's fun for the most part. <laughs> So as you saw in our stud counter now, we've uh, gotten up to 700 billion. Uh, ridiculous. Isn't still counting. Um, I'm not sure how high it's going to go. We're hoping that it's going to be 999 billion, 999 million, 999,999. Um, hopefully. Hopefully that's the, the, the end. But uh, we're going to find out. <sighs> One thing to note is that this game has ridiculous long load times because the hub worlds are pretty pretty big. But basically, this is the world that we've been doing over and well, at least the one I've been doing over and over again because you really can get quite a few studs. Um, always remember to put your uh, extras on. Got to have those multipliers at least, and you know the snake whip. Why not? And all these other stud magnets and invincibility, all that fun stuff. Uh, just to make the levels easier and to increase your studs. And it makes it easier to collect the studs in the first place. So this is the level I've just been kind of doing over and 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 over again. So just because you can get quick studs and a lot of studs in a fairly decent, about a minute and a half to two minute range. Um, getting quite a few uh, studs here. So interesting to note is whenever you get the little uh, either jump icons or the boost icons, it seems like you actually, the stud counter actually counts your studs worth more for whatever reason. So I try to, while I'm collecting studs, always to have one of those. Um, it just seems like you get more because whenever I don't collect them, you don't get anywhere close to what you would have if you do have it collected. So it's kind of weird and doesn't make really much sense, but it... It's, hey, it, that's what works, so that's what I'm doing. So yeah, this is, I pretty much found the perfect uh, way to get through this stage. Um, just going through and collecting lots and lots of blue studs here. Uh, a few purples, but mostly blue. And then of course you have your regular silver and gold ones. But uh, it's pretty cool. But I gotta say, I am 
really sick. I just, at this point, I've done this level so many times now that it, I just know it works. And to think about deviating at this point is just, it's going to take more time. And I'm just ready for the game to be done now. <laughs> so, I know a lot of people are like, you're an idiot. Why do you even play anymore if it's not fun? Well, it's that sense of accomplishment. You got to get it. So, come this far. Might as well go the last little bit. So, right there you get massive studs. So, as you see, about you get sometimes you can get about 1.7, if, if depending on... Uh, how fast you are on certain points, but uh, that's basically that's basically it, guys. So hopefully you enjoyed the video. I know it's not the most exciting video ever, but hey, figured I'd show what's going on with this game and what I've been playing and what I've been doing. So I usually do about 25 billion a day is my goal. So anyway, see you in the next video, guys. Thanks for watching. See you.